took it the bucket by Curly Manicaville. Tucket was the saddest bucket in the world. He had once been a garden favorite. The gardener used to swing him by his strong handle as he went to fetch water. What a good bucket, he said. But as time passed, Tucket, the bucket, grew a hole. Suddenly, he was useless. What good is a bucket with a hole? Tucket was tossed into the corner of the garden. He was left out in the rain and the sun and began to rust. Sometimes he even got kicked around. I should throw that bucket away, the gardener muttered. Tuckett didn't want to be thrown away. He felt very sad, though his good friends in the garden tried to cheer him up. The squirrels set him back up when he was kicked down, and the birds cheerfully flapped about him. Don't worry, Tuckett, they chirped soothingly. Tuckett really tried to be happy, but it was very, very hard. One day, a little girl ran through the garden and stopped in front of Tuckett. He sighed and waited for the usual kicks when suddenly he heard, Perfect! Soon he found himself blinking and spluttering under the garden hose. The girl was cleaning him. He felt heavy chunks of rust fall off, and his spirits brightened. Oh, you already have a big hole at the bottom, said the girl as she peered inside. Even better. Tuckett could not believe what he had just heard. She wanted a bucket with a hole? The girl took him to the veranda, filled him with rich soil, and planted a tiny rose inside. This is a baby rose, she said to Tuckett. You must help me take care of her, okay? Tuckett was so happy. The girl really wanted him. She even asked him to take care of this small rose. Tuckett nearly burst with joy. He straightened himself up proudly as the girl finished planting. She carefully placed Tuckett in the best spot of the veranda. It was a cozy corner, protected from the wind and the rain. Tuckett winked and smiled at his friends in the garden. Look, I'm taking care of this little rose. We're very happy for you, Tuckett, chattered the squirrels, and the birds chirped happily. Tuckett took great care of the rose and was visited by the girl and his friends every day. He was now the happiest bucket in the world. <laughs>